Hello, we are discussing about GATE 2012 ECE paper. Look at the feedback system shown below that is oscillating at 2 radians per second. Oscillations are 2 radians per second is nothing but omega is n is equal to 2 radians per second. Okay. And next. So for what values of k and a, the feedback system is oscillating at 2 radians per second. This can be calculated from Ruth Hurwitz criteria. Ruth Hurwitz criteria generally talks about the stability of the system. Okay. So if you are going for the Ruth array, in that one first column should have all positive elements. All elements must be positive to have stability. And if you are going with a case, if okay, a row consisting of all zeros, then the system is going to be oscillating with a fixed frequency. So this is the case which is related to that one. So where in Roth criteria you must get a row of zeros. Then we can say that one the system is oscillating at some frequency. That frequency can be calculated by using auxiliary equation that is the row just above this all zeros row. From that one we will use the coefficients of that row and we will write an auxiliary equation and we will solve this one to get the value of omega n. Okay, so we re first we need to construct the row array for this one and then we have to get all zeros row. Then we are going to calculate the omega n required. That is for the required omega n what is the condition for k and a can be calculated. Okay, so row array is going to be first of all the order is s power 3. So row array is going to be always requires. Routh array or Routh Hurwitz criteria is always uses characteristic equation. Characteristic equation is nothing but 1 plus gh is equal to 0. Okay. And h is nothing but transfer uh, feedback transfer function. Since it is unity feedback, h of s is equal to 1. So simply h of s is equal to 1, it is approximately equal to 1 plus g is equal to 0. So this is g value. Okay. And substitute that one. So 1 plus g is nothing but k into s plus 1 divided by s cube plus a s square plus 2s plus 1 that is equal to 0. After simplifying you will get the characteristic equation if you take this term common and that will be send it to right side that will get 0. So finally you are going to get the characteristic equation as s cube plus a s square plus 2s plus 1 plus k k s plus k is equal to 0. Add similar coefficient terms so that s is cube plus a s square plus s coefficient is 2 as well as k. So s into k plus 2 you can write and the other one is nothing but k plus 1 is equal to 0. This is one constant. So this is characteristic equation for the given unity feedback system. So now I am writing it with s cube and s square. s cube coefficient is 1, s square coefficient is a and s coefficient is k plus 2 and s power 0 coefficient is k plus 1. So you can write s power 1 row. Okay. So a into k plus 2 minus k plus 1 divided by a. So a into k plus 2 minus k plus 1 into 1 that is k plus 1 itself divided by a and the other side it doesn't have any row so that it will be 0. So if this value will be 0 then you will get a all zeros row. Okay. So if a into k plus 2 minus of k plus 1 by a is equal to 0 then you will get a all zeros row. All zeros row that means the system is oscillating at undamped natural frequency. Okay. So what is the condition for this one? If you are simplifying this A will be going towards right side. So it will be get 0 and k is equal to A into k plus 2 is equal to k plus 1. So A is equal to you will get it as k plus 1 divided by k plus 2. k plus 1 divided by k plus 2 this is first equation. A value we got. A value is k plus 1 by k 
k plus 2 and frequency of oscillations can be calculated from the auxiliary equation. Frequency of calculations can be calculated from auxiliary equation. That auxiliary equation I can write from the row just above this all zeros row. Okay. So this is all zeros row. So the above row zeros this one. Now it is becoming zero. So that above zero is nothing but a and k plus one. So auxiliary equation can be written as a s square plus k plus one is equal to zero. So a s square is equal to okay a s square is equal to minus of k plus one and s square is equal to minus of k plus one by a and minus minus square root if you take both sides square root minus is nothing but you will get it as j so j and k plus one by a square root as so plus or minus j times of square root of k plus one by a otherwise you can write this one as k plus one a value if you substitute k plus one by k plus two so you will get it as minus of k plus two so directly you can write it as s is equal to instead of writing this one s is equal to plus or minus j square root of k plus two so from this one s value has to be positive so that we are going with k plus two is equal to k plus two this is k plus 2 and k is equal to 2 so k plus 2 square root of k plus 2 is equal to 2 radians per second it has given that one okay plus or minus j omega plus or minus square root of k plus 2 is equal to 2 radians per second so we will consider only positive sign because it is 2 radians per second is given so from this one take square root on both sides it will be k plus 2 is equal to 4 and k is equal to 4 minus 2 that is 2 radians per second 2 radians per second so k value is 2 radians and now we need to calculate the a value so a value is going to be from the equation 1 k value is 2 so 2 plus 1 is 3 2 plus 2 is 4 3 by 4 is nothing but 0 0.7 so a value is 0 0.7 and k value is 2 because it has given the s value oscillation frequency is 2 radians per second so you are substituting s value as 2 radians and this is plus or minus you are getting but we will consider only positive sign because the radians per second is positive from that one you can obtain the k value k value is 2 and from that k value a value is 0 0.75 so k is 2 and a value is 0 0.75 the right option is a thank you